Yo, what's going on guys? So today is going to be a very, very interesting day. So today I'm going to be trying something that McDonald's started, I want to say a couple weeks ago. Um, or at least they announced it a couple weeks ago. And it's called the Menu Hacks. They have something called a Crunchy Double, which is a double cheeseburger and a six-piece nugget with barbecue sauce. Uh, they have something called Surf and Turf, which I'm pretty sure is a double cheeseburger again, but with a fish filet sandwich. And then they have the Big Boy, which is the one I'm going to be trying in this video. The Land, Air, and Sea, which is a McChicken a fish filet and a big mac all all put together now here's the thing um i work at a mcdonald's so i already know um this but it bothers me how much people don't know this um it's called menu hacks and all of the advertisements show the picture of the entire sandwich together we don't make it like that we we make the three individual things and then you put it together yourself because um the thing itself is literally like what's it called it the advertisement for it literally says we bag you build um so what i'm doing today uh i i ordered the big boy right so it comes with a fish filet sandwich a big chicken and a big mac um i purposely ordered them with no bun the big chicken and the filet because i'm just gonna be putting it on the big mac with the big mac bun so i feel like if i ordered i, I would have three buns for one sandwich and i don't need that so i say that when the big mac has three buns i meant to say i have three sets of buns for one sandwich and that's unnecessary so i personally ordered them with no bun i have no idea what to expect and here's the thing i've seen people on tiktok who are like oh my god it's so good it complements each other so well and like here's the thing i'm not i'm not gonna be like talking bad about it because i work at a mcdonald's that, that I, that's like illegal i'm gonna get shot or something but i can't imagine it actually tastes good so i really want to see if people are just clickbaiting and are like, oh my god, it's so good, you need to try this, or if it's actually good. So I'm gonna try it, let you guys know. If it's terrible, I'm gonna warn you so you don't have to try it. Um I'm scared. Here's the thing though, I think it's really weird. I've tried all of these things, except for I actually have never had a Big Mac from McDonald's. Because the Big Mac is like four dollars, and if you get a McDouble add lettuce and add Mac sauce, it's essentially the same thing. So I've had that, but I've never had an actual Big Mac. So I'm intrigued. I don't I don't know what to expect with this. Oh, I got it. Also, damn, they were fucking fast. I placed my order, recorded my intro, which was about two minutes long. And the lady was literally like already at my window, like your mobile order for Blake. And I was like, yes. Okay, that was fast. Also, I kind of wish I went through the drive-thru because the person in the drive-thru looks like a really pretty person. And they're wearing like a flannel jacket over their uniform. And I really want to compliment them, but I can't because they're in the window and I'm i'm here anyways oh they did this cool thing and I'll, I'll talk about it later once i get to my house because i want to hurry up and get to my house um but they did this cool thing and i kind of wish my mcdonald's did this because this look this looks like way more efficient and smart why is that so slanted why are you, why are you so slanted why am i sideways i don't i don't want to be sideways why am i slanted so much do i have anything else i can use to prop my phone up a little bit here this 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 might help a little bit i, I honestly have no idea Am I now slanted the other way? Okay, well, this is my life now. Okay, yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy. So, um, I successfully made it home. Amen. Thank you. Um, anyways, the weird thing that I was talking about that I was like, oh my god, this is really smart. I wish my McDonald's did this. Instead of, uh, if you've ever ordered a sandwich or anything from McDonald's and you got it with no bun, it usually comes on a really long black tray. And if you get a small sandwich, it looks really stupid and ridiculous. Uh, but what they did was instead they put them in boxes. So this six piece box has my fish filet in it with no bun. And then my McChicken is in a 10 piece box, which I thought was really funny. Cause I'm like, why is it, why is it like that? Um, beautiful 10 out of 10. I just, it looks so much better. And this makes it so much easier because I'm about to assemble this burger. Um, here's the thing. I'm making it just straight up as it is instead of how I would want it to be. Cause I'm trying it as it is because that's basically what the customers do. And I'm just going to do what the customers do. I'm going to try to show you my assembly process. So first things first, take it off the top bun. If you don't know how a Big Mac is made, they usually make it... Here, let me lift this up. They usually make it so that the sandwich is made... Some of it's on this bun, some of it's on the bottom bun. And then they'll pick this up and put it on the bottom bun. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the filet on the bottom bun and I'm I'm gonna put this on top of it and I'm gonna put the Big Mac, I mean the, the McChicken on the top bun. This is gonna be really weird because it's all this, all of the different sauces that we have at McDonald's combined except for, you know, mustard and ketchup. Um, 
this is really interesting. And I've never had a Big Mac before, so I don't know. I don't know if I like this. Um, anyways, so I'm just gonna do it. What's the worst that'll happen? And then something that's good about this, um, the the Big Mac and the McChicken both come with lettuce, so I'm gonna have like extra lettuce and stuff. It's gonna be really nice. Okay, but anyways, yummy fish fillet. If that if that doesn't look appealing to you, I don't know what does. It does not look good at all. I don't I don't like the fish fillet. Is tartar sauce good? I mean, it's not bad. It's, it's basically just mayonnaise and then diced pickles, basically. I don't know. I mean, it, it's 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 all right. Anyway, so the bottom is a 10-in-1 patty. Lettuce, a piece of cheese, onions, and mac sauce. And there's also tartar sauce on it. Um, and then top bun. Well, in between the middle bun and the top bun. You get more lettuce, more onions, Big Mac sauce. A piece of 10 and one there should be pickles yep pickles and then now they make chicken with extra lettuce oh absolutely scrub delicious i'm gonna be honest their lettuce looks better than my my lettuce at my mcdonald's i'm kind of offended oh this looks absolutely atrocious i i hate everything about this okay hold up i'm gonna have to do a glamour shot of this because this is this is funny to me okay okay so there's no way I'm gonna be able to eat this right. I might, I might go get a plate and a fork and knife. There's, yeah, this is holy shit. And I'm gonna be honest, this does not look appealing at all. I'm not, I'm not gonna enjoy this. Alrighty, so I have it crafted. Uh, I have it on the plate. I do want to go ahead and say the McDonald's I went to did a really good job. This is like the neatest Big Mac I've ever seen. I took it out of the box. I didn't spill any lettuce, and there's like no mess in here. There's usually a mess in here, so it's kind of impressive. Um. I'm gonna try picking it up and taking a bite out of it. More than likely, I'm gonna need to use a fork and knife. I'm not showing the knife blade because I don't want this to get taken down. Oh, I, I showed it. I'm I'm gonna get sued. I'm gonna lose all my money. YouTube's gonna hate me. It's called the Land, Air, and Sea. I think it should be called the fucking monstrosity. Um, it is. It. it I mean, whose idea was this? Like genuinely, like I I bet they came up with the name and they're like, oh my god, yeah, that's good. Um, and they didn't really think out, think through the fact that it was going to be, like, a sandwich. Anyways, so, I cut it in half. If you want to see the inside of it. I'm going to cry. This does not look good at all. Alright, I'm just going to take one big bite, and I'll tell you how it is. I might be biting my own words here. I'm gonna be honest, that first bite, that was really good. What, why, why does that work? Why does that work? I'm gonna try another bite. And if I like it again, I think I might be, I might be concerned for my own mental health. What? Why is that good? That's not supposed to be good. I, you know what? I'm gonna just say at McDonald's, you, you surprised me with this one. Um. Wow. Okay, uh, I'm going to go ahead and rate it. Um, first of all, the McDonald's I went to was 10 out of 10 service. It was really good. They always do really, really good. They explained to me the whole, hey, by the way, uh, we just put them in boxes and then the forks are in the bag and everything. And I was like, oh my God, okay, cool, interesting. Uh, the person seemed really, really sweet. Like I said, the person in the window looked really pretty and I wanted to compliment them, but I couldn't because, you know. Um, so overall, service... 9.7 out of 10. Excellent. Um, the food itself. Here's the thing. Uh, my food was definitely fresh because I came like right when they were switching to lunchtime. So the longest anything could have been sitting out was like maybe like five or 10 minutes. This was really good. This was really good. I, I would almost recommend this. I would recommend this. This was good. Why was this good? No idea. I would rate it a 9.3 out of 10. That was, I would order that again. I, I'm not. I'm not gonna have any shame in that. I would order that again. Why? Why does it work? I'm uncomfortable now. Um, but yeah. Anyways, uh, that's gonna be it for this video. I'm gonna go rethink my entire life choices. Um, hopefully, you guys enjoy this video. I uh, hope you, you guys are having a good day. Uh, if you try this, and you want to tell me what your thoughts on it, let me know. Um, but anyways, yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Hope that you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.